The major goals of these kits is to provide children with autism and other special needs and um, disabilities the tools necessary to receive the Sacrament of Penance, Eucharist and Confirmation for the first time. Now, for example, in the Eucharist kit you will find um, a picture missile, which is a, um, a flip book and mass picture cards, which is wonderful to assist the individual to maintain focus throughout mass. There is a sequence puzzle, uh, Bless Yourself, showing the individual how to make the sign of the cross. There is a, um, an activity asking the question, who is Jesus? And this um, introduces and reinforces Jesus as the Son of God and relates God's family to the individual's family so it can be really catered to the family. Um, it also highlights um, in a food matching puzzle that um, communion is not the same as other food. It helps the individual distinguish that um, between the Eucharist and uh, ordinary food. Um, there is another sequence puzzle which is very, very similar to um, a picture exchange communication system. How do I receive communion? Showing the steps of receiving communion reverently and providing a guide for the individual to practice at home. And this sequence actually begins with standing in line with other members of the parish community because for some individuals that in itself can be quite challenging So and, and being close to other people. Um, there is an instruction story which is lovely. Um, I received the communion and this booklet once again reinforces uh, the reference and uh, the proper steps for receiving communion. But it also highlights some lovely things. It highlights the fact that um, when we receive communion, sometimes it's the priest that we receive communion from, but other times it can be a man or a woman, and that, that's okay, it's still Jesus, nothing changes. And um, there was also, um, and I must admit, um, having been um, a primary teacher and worked with junior children for quite um, a number of years, they would often tell me, what does it taste like? What does the mm -hmm. communion taste like? And they're so excited when they finally get to grade three and they're able to um, make their um, first Eucharist, um, you have to really explain that um, sometimes you may not like the way that it tastes, but you still eat it up in this. And I think that that's really important. Mm -hmm. And that's something that I had to do with children mm -hmm. in a mainstream classroom, mm -hmm. which was great. Um, and there's also a helper guide there um, to be read by the parent, just to provide um, a little bit of an idea as to how the, the parent, the teacher and the catechist uh, can fully utilise the kit.